Blessings from our new person. <laughs> yes, we got a new mantle. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> and there's a lot of news, so I want to cover the news here shortly. I just want to show you that Chris put together a great piece of work here. Just real quickly. That's just part of the mantle. And it was installed today in the living room. And we still have renovations that are going on in the kitchen to finish the paint. And I did tell you I will have a video of that too. But don't you just love the cross? Look at that. The cross and the candle. Perfect. Beautiful. It's called. Beautiful. Okay. All right. So the news. Um, now, with the partial solar eclipse, it didn't, like, directly affect us because, obviously, it was in the tip of Africa, uh, parts of Asia, and South America. So, it didn't, like, exactly affect us as far as, like, weather-wise or anything directly. But what does this mean spiritually? Those are the questions we should be asking ourselves. So, that be the question. Well, in the Bible, it says that the uh, sun will turn dark and the moon will turn red. Well, it just so happens that we are going to have a blood moon November 8th. So, that is something to watch for. Now, Wallytron has a video about this very topic and much more that there's asteroids coming that are large, massive. Um, he seems to believe that they have something to do with the return of the Lord. So, this is all news. Now, with Russia looking at nuclear war as the next option, this is like looking like Chernobyl times two. And that's what Watchwoman65 just posted on her blog. So, I'm going to post Wally Tron's video link in the description box below. In the meantime, enjoy the backdrop because this is the backdrop. Um, I might use other back. I might use the backdrop that I had before, but I really like this. It's very conservative and clean, you know. <laughs> I love it. So, I'm just relaxed and wanted to post an update on the solar eclipse and what does this mean? And it means possibly what it says in the Bible. Just like I said earlier, the Bible says that the moon turns to dark like sackcloth and then not the moon, the sun turns black like sackcloth and the moon turns blood red before the great and terrible day of the Lord. So, we have a lot to consider when this comes to pass. <sighs> like Jesus returns. Praise God. All right, thank you for watching and God bless.